the crash. Actor Danny Masterson has been charged with raping three women between 2001 and 2003, the Los Angeles District Attorney's Office announced on Wednesday. Masterson, 44, was charged with three counts of rape, and faces up to 45 years in prison if convicted. He was arrested by the LAPD Robbery Homicide Division on Wednesday morning, and was released in the afternoon on $3.3 million bail. An arraignment has been set for September 18. The former That 70s Show actor is accused of raping a 23-year-old woman sometime between January and December of 2001. He allegedly raped a 28-year-old woman in April 2003. And the charges allege that raped another 23-year-old woman at his Hollywood Hills home between October and December of 2003. Tom Mesereau, Masterson's attorney, issued a statement vowing to fight the charges. Mr. Masterson is innocent, and we're confident that he will be exonerated when all the evidence finally comes to light and witnesses have the opportunity to testify, Mesereau said. Obviously, Mr. Masterson and his wife are in complete shock considering that these nearly 20-year-old allegations are suddenly resulting in charges being filed, but they and their family are comforted knowing that ultimately the truth will come out. The people who know Mr. Masterson know his character and know the allegations to be false. Masterson has been under investigation by the LAPD since late 2016. He was dropped from the Netflix series The Ranch in December 2017 amid renewed focus on sexual misconduct in the wake of the Harvey Weinstein scandal. Masterson has vehemently and repeatedly denied the allegations. The district attorney's office also said Wednesday that it had declined to file charges against Masterson in two other cases. In one of those cases, a woman alleged that she had been repeatedly raped by Masterson while living with him in 2002. Prosecutors declined to file charges due to insufficient evidence, according to a charge evaluation worksheet. In the second instance, a woman alleged that Masterson had raped her twice, once at his home, and once at hers, while she was unconscious in August and September of 1996. That case was declined due to the statute of limitations.